Hello, my name is Mark Reynolds from Blazon Web Marketing. Today we're going to be looking at how to upload documents to your website using Joomla 1.5 and also using Docman, which is a component for Joomla which enables you to upload the documents. Okay, so we're going to log in here. So you should have login details already. Okay, now we're on the main screen here, um, and we're going to be going to the menu at the top, hovering over Components, and then hovering over Docman and clicking on Home. Okay, then we look to make sure we've got some categories because we want to, when we upload the documents, we want to be nice and organised. So yes, we have there. Um, and then we go, we've got, you'll notice we've got files and documents. To begin with, you upload the file that you, from your own computer. So we're on here, now we click on the upload button at the top right. And it gives us the option to upload a file from your computer. Make sure that's selected, then click next. And then it's gonna be, ask us to choose the file. So we're gonna click on choose file. And then we're gonna click on the file we want to upload. So annual report in this case and then we click on submit. You see Docman is uploading and then we've got success here. Now when you upload the files we also need to attach it to a document before it's viewed on the front end by the public. So we're going to click on this first one which is make a new document entry using this file. All files if they're going to be viewed on the front end need to have a document attached to it. So uh, give it a name first. And then make sure it's in the right category and your reports approved and published we're going to say it's approved and we're going to publish it as well as soon as we click save if you don't want it approved and published then make sure and no until you're ready to make it live to the public make sure you put a nice usable description in here so that people viewing your download from the front end of your website get a bit more uh, context to what's included in the download that's very important and then here, we just make sure we've got the right date in. The date's backwards here, so just be aware of that. The year here, then the month, and then the day. So make sure you insert when it was created. So in this example, I'm just gonna change it back a year. Um, okay, and there's other options here. Permissions, whether your document's got a license, which it probably won't have. And another tab so you know if you're you need to um, maintain permissions etc on who can download and view the file then uh, they can all be controlled from here so we'll click save now okay save documents save changes and then we're ready to go because as well as having the document here the document is linked to the file that we uploaded and now we're going to be viewing the front end. So this is the website, and this is just a test view we have here. This is a design that's uploaded with Joomla itself, so not one that's created by us. We're going to refresh this page, and then we will see that the annual reports category has got one file in it now. So we're going to click on the category. Here it is, Debenhams Annual Report. And then we can click view or download, click on view. Then here we go, we've got the annual report there, really nice and easily to view. And then or we can click on download. And then just out of view here for you, but in our browser, it's given us an option to save at the bottom of it. And then you can just save it to your computer or your user can. So that's it, it's pretty simple. If you have any questions on anything that we've discussed here or on uploading documents to your website, then please contact us at Blazing Web Marketing. Thank you very much.